story. And I think that the alien is going to be music. <laughs> <laughs> Friday, the 13th, 1972, the plane carrying 45 passengers, most of them students and private players, crashed into the Andes Mountains. Those who survived lost, lost hope with each day, as their food supply diminished and the temperatures fell to 30 degrees below zero. Cold and starving, they were forced to make a difficult decision to feed on the bodies of their dead teammates. Today, this is not going to be the case. <laughs> I promise. <laughs> Eventually, two of the players decided to trek across the huge mountain in hopes of finding civilization and fun. They continued to endure below freezing temperatures with little food as they walked for 10 days. <coughs> Challenging their lives each step of the way as they climbed the mountain. Finally together they reached the top of the peak. But their hopes of finding help on the other side were dashed when they found only more peace. One after the other, and one after the other. I met one of the survivors. His name is Nando Barbara. And he told me about his harrowing event and how, because of his passion, spirit, and will to live, he was able to find the inspiration to continue walking from one peak to the next. Even under the most grueling circumstances, until they were able to find civilization. Like life, there is never just one peak. Once you reach the top of one, you will always find another. Today, I'm being inducted into the advertising hall of achievement. This is a great honor for me. And I have many people to thank for helping me get here, helping me to reach many peaks in my life leading to this particular one. My wife, Catalina, here. My children, Matias and Eloisa. My parents, my grandmother, my entire family. My friends, my colleagues, my competitors. From one thing, to another. Without people, this business is nothing. It's impossible to make it. Eighteen years ago, when I was young, I started and I was hired as a training copywriter in Bogota, Colombia, South America. And that was my first year. And today, with this award, with this achievement, I am at the top of a new peak. But I understand that in front of me, I have an open view of more peaks. New challenges, new goals to reach, new people to learn from. It's a never ending story that makes me happy, very happy. I'm a very fortunate person. I love what I do. And I come from the Andes Mountains. I love to reach peaks. Thank you so much. Bye -bye.